Stuff like that, I was like, <laughs> wait, it's like, you want to do It's feeling to be the first guy from Guam to represent our island in New York City. Like, be dependent for Hawaii and then be for Guam. We're red warriors and it's in our blood to, to fight growing up. Everybody has to get into a scrap, whether it's with their family member or somebody that they know from school. But it's just an island of, of warriors and fighters. Uh, fighting the only Chinese on the main card in China. No sweat for me, he has all the pressure, you know. Um, I'm just gonna go there and do what I do best. And, from all the W. I'm taking care of everything that I needed to from training and eating correct and getting enough sleep and just keeping my mind right and just training like a champion and living every day like a champion and you know that's that's all I could ever do to become the best. Experience and tough, you know, it's bad break, you know, whatever shit happens, but God had his plans and uh, I got to be with my family after and, you know, blessing in disguise, got to show that I had heart in, in the fight and, you know, show where I'm from and being that I'm back in the UFC, it's just, just a, a dream come true and a blessing from God and I couldn't have it any other way, and now I can show the world more of what a, I'm all about. I was, I was just uh, excited, you know? Couldn't, like, sleep. Um, I was just too excited. I was just overwhelmed with joy and, and happiness. And just knew that, that all my hard work is getting me to where I need to be. And now I fight in the UFC and I only can look towards the belt and get to it. They worked with uh, they worked with one of the guys I know, Jeff Clark, he managed me too as well. And um, being that I have a good a good fan base in in Asia, it just fit out perfectly for me and they knew that I was a tough fighter, so why not have me um, fight in the UFC with the best? Uh, I just want to have fun with the key, and jiu-jitsu is my my strong point. So I just gotta keep it, you know, keep it to my roots and train with the key, and it makes a makes me. It's a great way of cutting weight as well, putting on the gi and rolling. But other than that, I think gi and no gi complement each other and um, just want to make my game tighter in any way possible. Uh, my game plan going in is to go in there and fight like I always do and, and put on an exciting fight for the UFC and everybody in the world to watch and get some highlight reels as well. So. Looking forward to an amazing show. You've been training hard and so have I. We're fighting in your hometown, but hey, that's cool. Um, let's put on an amazing show for the first UFC in history in China and, you know, make it a fight to be talked about for ages. Um, I'm happy that I got to represent Guam in the UFC and thank you for all your support and I hope you guys keep following and keep updated with, with uh, my every move and in my career and see you with Masi. Thanks, Marva competitors for always, always hooking me up and taking care of me and appreciate all the, the help and support.